I think that the characteristic of the laser uh, school uh, is that our training here, it's not for many people and we try to do it very small groups, no more than five, so we can be one-on-one -on -one and we can really teach them and they have the opportunity to do things, and especially in operating room. And the idea of having less people is that it's very dynamic. We can adapt ourselves, as you saw yesterday, to the needs of the people. So if we see that someone is lacking some of their skills, basic skills, so we try to work with them on that, not running to the laser. I think the laser is the last thing you should do. Uh, you first need to be a good surgeon of the uterine cavity, and that's what we focus here. You need to know how to perform uh, good uh, intrauterine surgery, uh, not with a resectoscope, but with 30 degrees uh, scopes, so you can learn how to move inside the cavity. And the importance of the laser, it's not so big. The important thing is to know how to move inside the cavity because uh, the, the laser is the tip of the scope. The laser is not moving, what's moving is the scope. So you need to know how to perform good hysteroscopy in order to become a surgeon with laser. And that's what we are doing here. Uh, first, we, uh, uh, we are focused on giving them the skills and then what we do today, we they try the laser, but they, have, they need this, this, this hysteroscopy skills.